Hello guys, welcome to another episode of the Eastbourne Fishman. Uh, today is a mini, fish, mini fishers adventure. I brought my son Harry here, and Harry, how old are you? Eight. He's eight years old, and Very it's his shiny. first time night fishing. Um, in the last episode, we brought the girls night fishing, and unfortunately, we didn't catch any fish. Tonight, Harry, do you think we're going to catch some fish? Yes. Yeah. And the bait that we're going to be using is squid. Well, we got squid, we got giant ragworm, and we've also got lugworm as well. Um, yeah. All being locally sourced, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, what we're going to be doing is um, it's pretty windy today, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop him on a free hook flapper. Uh, we've only got one rod, uh, so you know it's all up to you. Um, yeah. You can decide what bait we use, Harry. Uh, you know, yep. you can decide. You know. I'm deciding what the rigs we're doing. Yeah, we're doing a free hook uh, flapper rig, but yeah. you can decide on the bait what you put on each hook. Yeah. Okay, right. What kind of fish do you want to catch? What's your target fish? That you Smooth want? hound, because yeah. I've never catched one before, but I have caught a Bernard. Yeah. And that's before your YouTube channel. YouTube channel. You did, didn't on, you? Yeah. Yeah, you did really good. Yeah. Yeah, we caught on some lugworm last summer, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, that was the first time doing it, so I needed your help. So that's got into yours as well. Yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to turn we the camera it? around. Then we're going to show you the bait that we're using. We'll show you how we're going to um, hook up the bait. Obviously, Harry won't be able to do that because he's only young. You don't want to get him you know, a hook in his finger. If you're doing the bait for you, you know, if, if you're with children, make sure you do the bait for the kids um, yeah. until they're old enough to do it themselves, obviously. I'm going to show them the tent. We will show them the tent later. Uh, also, if you guys want um, any of the new merch, this one here, I'm Social Fish that's in t shirt, hook me up um, or come and join our Facebook group uh, to find out all the details on how you can purchase. And there's free stuff. There might be some free stuff as well. Right. Yeah. So, um, let's get. Let's show everybody the bait. Let's show everybody the bait, uh, and then we'll carry on with the rest of the session. Right, so we're just going to run you through the bait. We're going to do it slightly differently. I'll spin the camera around in a minute so you can actually see the bait. But what we're going to do is Harry's going to tell you what bait we got. So this bait here is a. Um, what's that? I think it's a lugworm. It's a lugworm. It's a, it's a lugworm. So there's a lugworm bait there. Um, then we've got some. Uh, need to defrost this a little bit of some salt water but we do have uh, some squid yeah. uh, and then the last one we have I can't remember the name of this these bad boys absolutely massive and that is what do you think that is um, what does it look like uh, centipede centipede that my friend is a ragworm king ragworm okay a king one a king ragworm because it's so big uh, there's absolutely some really big ones there. Look at the size of that one. Look at the Ooh. size of that. Absolutely massive. Right. That looks like a good one. So let's flip the camera around. We'll show you the baits in closer detail. Then we will rig up. Uh, then we're going to get cast out and we'll let you know how we get on for the evening. Right, just to show you the bait then. So we've got the, the, the ragworm there. Quite a lot of ragworm there. We've got to get through this evening. Uh, we've got some frozen squid there and some lugworm there. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're just going to get them on the hooks um, and then we'll cast out. Right, so what we're going to do is we are, we're just using one rod today, like I said. We've got a uh, red grip lead, because it's quite windy. And then we're just running a free hook flapper. So Harry, what kind of bait do you want to put on this, this first one? Um, I think we'll start off with this one. A couple of bits of ragworm, and then uh, do you want to put a logworm on the bottom? Yeah, logworm yeah? on the bottom. The squids will last. Okay, no problem. So let's carry on and do that now. We're just going to flip the camera down and we'll show you how to do it. Right, so what we're going to do then, as Harry's asked, is we're going to take one of the ragworm. It's going to cut the head off to prevent it from nipping me. It's going to cut this in small sections so we can use so one there, one there and one there. And then he wants to use a lugworm on the bottom hook. So we're going to cut the bottom tail off there. And then what we're going to do is we're going to feed these up. So we're going to find the bottom hook first. Okay, are you watching Harry? Yep, we're just going to take the lugworm, the top of the lugworm, just going to pierce that through, and then we're just going to fold that down like that, just pushing it up the hook, okay, pushing it all the way on, leave a little bit off the end as like a little tail, and then we're just going to pull it up the hook, and that is one lugworm bait there, okay? Yep. What we're going to do with the ragworm is exactly the same. It's going to get the hook, 
You're going to take the pierce. ragworm. Yep. And pierce, pierce it through the top. Okay. Squirt it up. And then we're just going to come out just a little bit just before the bottom. Yep. Just like that. And that's a nice ragworm bait there. Okay. And again, we just do the same on the top hook. Which is here. Just going to put that through there. And again, a nice little ragworm bait there. Okay, so that's your first rig done. Yeah. What we're gonna do now is gonna bait up the second rig for you, okay? And then we're gonna cast out. Right, so uh, we're just looking at the sea now, so this is what we're, what we're up against. It's, uh, what do you think then, Harry? It's quite wavy and big. It's quite wavy, wavy and rough. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to cast things. out, hopefully just over the breaker, um, and then um, you know, lock the lead on the bottom uh, to hopefully you know, keep us in a straight line, all right? Yeah. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. Right, so as fishermen, we need a special kind of bait. So Harry's going to show you our bait for tonight. What have we got as bait? Um, what? What do we need? This is our bait. This is our Scooby Snacks. So Yummy. we have got some spaghetti. Yeah. My favourite, which I is strawberry laces. Oh, yum. We've also got some Haribo sort of y stuff. And we've got my favourite. Double chocolate digestives. <laughs> oh, drinkies! And we've got a nice bottle of ice cream, ice cream soda. So we are sorted. Mm. The bait's just been cast out. We're just going to sit here and we're just going to wait and uh, hopefully we'll be able to report something. I think Harry's quite excited, aren't you, Harry? Yes. Yeah? Especially for the cookies. Especially for the cookies. <laughs> right, so we are in the sea. Uh, it is really rough. So we are probably gonna, not going to be able to register any bites yeah. but we'll try our hardest and we'll reel in every 15 to 20 minutes if we haven't seen any significant knocks uh, and then we'll hopefully be able to show you some decent fish Open my oh, oh my goodness me <laughs> lovely yeah. right rock and roll right so unfortunately we've had no luck on the um, free hook flappers so what we've done now is we've on for this so this is a squid and ragworm cocktail which is there so we're going to get that out it's on a tried pulley rig uh, we're going to clip that down and get that right over the breaker it's just getting pretty rough now and we need to be right out there um, uh, as, as far as we can get out right then so this is my first bait we put out on the big baits we've given up the free hook flappers just it's so windy and they keep tangling up so something's definitely had a go on that I heard the ratchet go and it's taken the chunk out the bottom, so definitely fish are here. Um, so that's, that's a positive sign. So uh, we're going to stick with the big baits, and hopefully we'll be able to get something decent. Harry's um, just been scavenging off next door, and uh, managed to get a whole selection of barbecued items from uh, some lad that Peter knows. So that's, that's a bonus, nice hot food there. Uh, so well done Harry. Yep, I had to use this. Yeah, you had to use his head torch as well, so that's a given. Um, we're just going to stick it out and see what happens in the next couple of hours, yeah. aren't we? Mm -hmm. Having fun? Yeah! Yeah, having fun being out at night? Yeah. Yeah, staying up later than everybody else at home, isn't you? Yeah. Yeah, rock and roll. The tide's right down at the low point. I'm down at the low point. Harry's up in the tent just having a quick scoff on all the food and uh, chilling out. There he is. Um, so yeah, got big baits out, big baits on at the minute. Big ragworm baits, big squid baits. Just clipping them down, just banging them out as far as we can. Um, I've had a couple of knocks and some missed bites. Uh, the seaweed is an absolute nightmare. Um, every every cast we're pulling the seaweed back off the line, which is you know it's not it's not great. So we're going to fish it for a couple more hours um, and then uh, see how we get on. Woo. Right, guys, just to show you the problem that we're getting every cast. This is my rig. <laughs> that is how much seaweed is coming in on every cast. So yeah, I'm just gonna run out run out the rest of the live bait and I think we're gonna up and leave it. So I'll keep you posted if we get anything um, and uh, we'll see what happens. Right guys, so we're now at the end of the session. Unfortunately, we didn't get any fish. How do you feel about that? Pretty sad, isn't it? But you know, 
Have you had good fun? Yeah. Yeah, what have you learnt today then? Different kinds of bait, yeah. different rigs, different weights and stuff. Yeah, how to put the bait on the hook. It's hard being a fisherman. It's hard being a fisherman, yeah. <laughs> Harry's had a little nap in the uh, in the tent because he's really tired. Uh, so what we're going to do now is we're going to pack up, uh, get him to bed because he's, you know, probably past his bedtime. It's 12 o'clock now. So everyone else at home is asleep. Yeah, do you want to come again? Yeah, did you enjoy it? Yeah? yeah. Right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to pack up. Um, in the end, it become unfishable. Uh, the amount of weed that we was pulling in, seaweed, was just ridiculous. I'll pop a post up and show you some of the pictures uh, of the seaweed that we were reeling in. And it just gets to a point where, you know, uh, you have to make too a decision. Much. Gets to a point there's too much weed. Um, and, you know, it's either, you know, cut your losses and pack up and try another day. Or, you know, f try and fish through it and just keep pulling weed off the line, which is absolutely ridiculous. In, in the end of it, you just end up throwing money into the sea using, you know, baits. And it's just, it's just no, cut off. Uh, Peter, over the other side of the groin, he, he's, had, he's had enough of it as well. I think he's packing up soon as well. Um, he's caught a couple of fish before I got here, uh, but yeah, since I've been here, it's been absolute pff, uh, weed nightmare. We tried big baits, small baits, tried pulley rigs, uh, free at flapper rigs, clip down rigs to try and get up over the breakers. Yeah, it's just exactly the same, just a weed situational nightmare. So, until next time, guys, we'll see you soon. Do you want to say bye bye? Bye bye. You come up and say bye. Bye bye. So, it's bye from me and bye from Harry, and hopefully, we'll get out bye. another mini fishers adventure soon. Uh, and we'll fish uh, a different tide. As soon as we can. As soon as we can. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Cheers, guys. Thanks very much.